Welcome back to Maca DIY that where I look at things around my home and attempt to recreate them. Today I'll be trying to make some cheese. More specifically, I'm attempting to make nabulsi cheese, but without rennet. To start, I'm boiling milk and then adding vinegar, which creates cheese curds. I'm then straining all of the cheese curds through a cheesecloth to remove all of the whey. After that, it's just a tedious process of squeezing as much whey out as possible. I've chosen to create nabulsi cheese because I'd like to continue exploring Palestinian culture in my kitchen. While on the topic of Palestine, let's talk about what's currently happening there. It has been over a hundred days of Palestinians losing their lives Lives, losing their families, losing their homes, losing their everything. And even after all of that, all of the freezing, all of the starving, they are still persevering with peace in their hearts and finding ways to continue. They are finding creative ways for heat sources, water sources, and even shelter. Their suffering has continued for over a hundred days because countries have chosen to put power and money over their lives. Getting back to the cheese, I'm just going to cut it up and add the heated salted whey. And now for my favorite part, the taste test. The texture was a little off, but the flavor was amazing, and I can't wait to use these in my Jibne sandwiches. Thank you.